Hi, my name is Greg Harrison. Today I'm going to talk to you a little bit about some hybrid picking for shred guitar. It's a technique that's more common to blues and uh, country and even some jazz, but uh, we're going to use it for some shredding so we can get some serious notage happening. Um, we're going to start off with this lick that's based on E minor pentatonic in the 12th position. Check it out. The idea is that I'm picking the highest note, the E, with my uh, ring finger, or sorry, uh, my middle finger on my pick hand. And I do a downstroke on, uh, on the B string. And then a hammer on, or a pull off and a hammer. So let's look at the left hand. Now let's look at the picking hand. Check out what's going on here. So nothing special there really. You can bar the 12th fret on the top two strings with your uh, fret hand if you want. It's kind of nice to have a little bit of that bleed there. Okay, the next lick is a very similar idea. It's, uh, it's just gonna be barring at the, at the uh, 15th fret rather than the 12th fret. So check it out, I'm using my ring finger here to bar and I'm playing the, the, the 15th on the high E and then on the uh, B string and then doing a pull off and a hammer on. And now, um, with, it's, the same, it's the same picking pattern with this hand, it's, it's a pluck with the middle finger and a downstroke, pull off, hammer on. So you can kind of work that up the tempo, it's gonna sound pretty cool. Now, the next thing we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna take that exact same lick, but we're gonna move it to some different frets, but keep our, uh, keep our home base here in 12th position. I'm gonna use all four fingers on my fretting hand for this one. I'm gonna start with a bar at the 15th fret with my middle finger. And I'm gonna hammer with my ring finger on the B string to the 17th fret. And then do the same move, do a pull off. And then I'm gonna hammer the uh, 19th fret. Okay, so now let's check out the picking. Cool, it's, a, it's, it's actually not a lot going on with the right hand. That's what's kind of cool about it. If you, were to, if you were to try to pick that, see how much motion my pick hand has to go through to do that. And I'm just too lazy for that, so <laughs> the hybrid picking works out, keeps my hand in position. Um, this next lick is, is an E minor lick or E Dorian lick. Um, the theory isn't really too pertinent right now, but it's more about the shredding. So check it out. It's going to be um, it's, it's similar to a Paul Gilbert lick. We're going to start on the high E, do a couple of pull-offs. I'm plucking that with the middle, uh, with the middle finger on my right hand. And I'm just going to catch a D on the B string with a downstroke. Pluck the high E at the 12th fret with the, the middle finger again. So the left hand. And then the, uh, the, the picking hand. All right, so here's that lick a little, a little quicker. And uh, we're going to take the same kind of concept, but we're going to start on the B string for this next one. Pretty exciting. So what we're going to do is uh, I'm going to start with a down stroke. Check out the right hand. And I'm going to do down, two hammers, and I'm going to pluck the high string, then a down stroke and then hammers and pulls. So 
So that's, that's kind of a cool little lick. I'll do it uh, at a medium tempo here. Speed it up. I kind of combine that idea from earlier with that, that kind of idea with the... You can kind of combine them all together. Um, all right, so that's pretty much it for the, uh, for the short examples. Now what I'm gonna do is show you in a context of a, of a real lick. Um, it's based on E minor, E Dorian, and the E blues scale. A lot of uh, wide stretches involved in this one for the fretting hand. So uh, let's check out the lick. I'm just gonna show it to you just so you can catch the, uh, just the fret hand first, and then we'll, we'll check out the pick hand, and then we'll play it up to speed. So here we go uh, for the fret hand. So that's the basic idea. Um, now let's check out the right hand for this. Enjoyed this lesson and uh, try taking these licks to the next level on your own.